Mars has fascinated humans for centuries. It's close enough to study in detail, similar enough to Earth to raise big questions, and different enough to remind us how fragile planets can be. Let's take a deeper look at the red planet, what it is today, and why it matters. Mars is the fourth planet from the Sun, just beyond Earth's orbit. It's about half Earth's diameter, with only 38% of Earth's gravity. The weaker gravity affects everything, from how the atmosphere behaves to how the long water can stay on the surface. If humans ever lived on Mars, this low gravity will be one of the biggest challenges to adapt to. Mars does have an atmosphere, but it's, it's incredibly thin, less than 1% of Earth's pr surface pressure. It's mostly carbon dioxide with traces of nitrogen and argon. That thin blanket offers little protection from radiation and can't hold heat well, which is why Mars is cold and dry today. Average temperatures hover around minus 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Mars gets its red color from iron oxide, rust, coating the planet's surface. That rust forms when iron reacts with oxygen, often in the presence of water. So the color of Mars isn't just cosmetic, it's evidence that water once played a major role in the shaping of the planet. Mars is home to some of the most extreme features in the solar system. Olympus Mons is the tallest volcano we know, nearly three times the height of Mount Everest. Valles Moranes is a canyon system stretching over 2,500 miles, deeper and longer than the Grand Canyon. These features form because Mars lacks plate tectonics. Once magma rises, it piles up instead of being recycled. Today, liquid water can't exist on Mars for too long, but signs of ancient rivers, lakes, and possible oceans are everywhere. Ice still exists at the poles and beneath the surface, locked away in frozen soil. Mars wasn't always dry, and that's one of the biggest clues scientists are still investigating. Mars looks quiet now, but it carries the scars of a very active past. In the next episode, we'll explore what Mars lost and how it changed the planet forever. Stay curious about space.